Hi friends, welcome to my YouTube channel Learn Commerce with Namita. I am Namita Mane. In today's video, let us solve the example of weighted average cost of capital. So this is the example on the screen. The entire capital structure of a company is provided along with the tax adjusted cost of each component. Determine the weighted average cost of capital. Now component of capital is given 12% debentures 30 lakhs the adjusted tax the tax adjusted cost of capital is 8% then 9% preferences 20 lakhs tax adjusted cost of capital 9% equity shares 50 lakhs and the tax adjusted is 14% now how to compute the weighted average cost of capital for this example. Now see computation of weighted average cost of capital. Now here I have prepared six tables sorry five tables. So first is component of capital in that I have written 12% debentures, 9% preference shares, equity shares. Amount of each capital that is 12% debenture is 30 lakhs. 20 uh, lakhs for preference shares equity shares 50 lakhs then total of this amount next is weight percentage or you can say proportion now how to find this weight or proportion percentage now divide 12 percent debentures that is 30 lakhs by this total okay so we get zero point three okay so how we got this weight the amount divided by total next we will get zero point two then zero point five okay so we how we got this weight percentage or proportion percentage see sometimes in the question they will give already okay now uh, and in some question they will not give so if they have not given in the question the proportion of weight percentage then we have to find it so how we can find it by adding by dividing this total this amount by the total 30 lakhs divided by 10 lakhs okay now next tax adjusted cost of capital percentage as it is take from the question 8% 9% 14% okay now weighted average cost of capital how we will get 0 0.3 into 8 we get 2.4 then next do multiply this column with weight by tax adjusted cost 0 0.2 into 9 1.8 0 0.5 into 14 7 now add all this 2.4 plus 1.8 plus 7 the total we get 11 point two percentage so 11.2 percentage is the weighted average cost percentage okay for this example i hope students you have understood how to calculate weighted average cost of capital if tax adjusted cost of capital is given okay thank you very much please subscribe my youtube channel like and share the video and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the latest notification.